I know a lot of folks are frightened of Robert F. Kennedy Jr. being a third-party candidate in November's presidential election. They think he'll take votes away from Joe Biden, and that kind of makes sense. He's a Democrat. He's a Kennedy. But I've always said I think he's going to take more votes away from Donald Trump, mainly because of his ideology. He's an anti-vaxxer, a conspiracy theorist. His thought process is more in line with the trump and I think those people that can't stomach Donald Trump anymore would vote for RFK Jr., Now, you know I'm not a big fan of polls. I think they're largely bullshit, but some of you motherfuckers love the polls, so let's talk about polls, something that substantiates what I'm saying. We've got three swing states, Michigan, Wisconsin, and Pennsylvania. Now, those polls say that Donald Trump is leading in each one of those states by a little bit. But what happens when they take the poll and they put RFK Jr. into the equation? Now, there's three people that people can vote for. You know how it turns out? Turns out Joe Biden wins in every one. So that proves, if you believe in polls, that Republicans are more likely to go with RFK Jr. because they can't stand Donald Trump, and RFK is crazy enough to fit in their mindset. Don't worry about RFK Jr. The motherfuckers that should be worried about RFK Jr. are the trump are the Republicans. And you can see them getting a little itchy about that. Whether J. RFK Jr. will actually be in the election in November, I'm not altogether sure. I have a feeling the Republicans are going to do everything they can to sink that motherfucker.